you know. What's up, guys? Hey, what's up? Welcome back to another episode of D and D, uh, and JD. Oh, whoa! That's us, uh, Dungeons and Dragons and Junk Drawer. Whoa! Yeah. So, uh, quick recap because we Enjoy watched the last episode last night as a quick refresher. Um, we fought five werewolves, uh, murdered all of them. I had the grossest high five in recorded history. Dope. And um, we met Gray, who healed Absidy, who was going to become a werewolf. And Josh was kind of upset a little bit that he didn't become a werewolf. Don't worry, there'll he be wants more it, opportunities. Because he Good. wants it a little bit. Like a little bit. Yeah. Not a lot of bit, but like a little bit. Yeah. Uh, a bit. Gray is now with the party. Uh, the sun's about to come up, and we learn that we can't long rest for another 24 <clears throat> hours. And Starting from the last time you long rested, so Josh, trying to lawyer your way. Doesn't it. it doesn't say that in the rule book? But that's yeah. fine. I'm well, God. I mean, yeah, it doesn't say it in the rule book. So. I'm God, so what I say goes. What if I don't believe in God? <coughs> you look and nothing like Morgan Freeman. Uh, I don't want to be Morgan Freeman. Yeah, he's bad uh, now. Not right now. That's right. Yeah, he's, he's bad, bad now too. He's bad now. You look nothing like Steve Carell. He's still good, right? He was, he was uh, Noah's Ark. He wasn't uh, God. Jim, Jim, Jim Carrey. Carrey. Different Bibles. Who's also Different crazy. Bibles. Whatever. Fine. Uh, He's an so, artist. yeah. That's where we <laughs> left off. Uh, Gray healed Absidy and healed, now uh, he's... you as well, I think. Did I get healed? One of you got healed like 10 points from him. I, I think that, that was me. Did not. It was you? Yeah. Okay, so he puts off and he pumped you full of something. Yeah, he did. <laughs> love. It's his uh, love pump. So, yes, you, you <laughs> met Gray, who is a, uh, just to recap, <laughs> Gray is Revenant. a half-elf revenant. His revenants are dope. Uh, so he's super undead. He's pale. He has th that slightly pale greenish uh, tinge to him. Uh, and as the, the sun starts to crest over and you're all tending to your wounds, he just kind of, he has his two axes shoved into one of the logs and he's just keeping his head in his hands at this point and he's muttering to himself in Elvish. Uh, can <clears throat> I... Can I understand it? I speak Elvish. You speak Elvish? It's I just do. motherfucking and son of... It's just... It's a lot of cursing to himself. Uh, I'd like to also in Elvish uh, look to him and just be like, I can understand what you're saying. I'm, I'm right here. Uh, do, great. Do you know what they're saying? Great. I okay. mean... Uh, we can communicate in Halfling if you want. <laughs> hey... <laughs> Hey, -o. um, I just, I, I, I thought I was done here and I'm just, I'm not, not a happy camper right now. Look, I, I understand, but we're, you're here. There's, there's no point in being upset because you're here. Well, I'm going to get ripped away again. That's uh, what well, I always do. I, I, I understand that, but there's no point in being upset about what's going to happen later <laughs> when there's a now we have to solve this now. Thank you. <laughs> God, I want to take it. And he off. takes out. Uh, you see him take out a scroll and he starts scribbling something down while you guys are, you know, slowly like, Absidy, you're, you feel you're so fucked up and you're super sore, but you know you're able to get up and walk around a little bit, hobble around, and Irina's like, you know, she's kind of just shaking under the the cloak because she's still got janked up from the right. from the he, fight. He helped Irina last yeah. episode. That's what it was. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I helped Irina. I helped Irina. No. <laughs> she legitimately was healed by this guy. I helped Irina. <sighs> what, is she, she like your girlfriend or something? Uh, no, they're having a bigger dick contest right now. Uh, can I'm I winning. use my... He's not. Uh, my inches. hit dice? Yeah, I'll let you use hit dice. Sweet. Which you can all use hit dice if yeah. you'd like. Oh, to, you're doing to a heal short up. rest? I'm going to do a short rest because I'm... We're, I'll consider 15. this a short rest because a short rest is anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour. And so this is... So it's just one hit it, dice? It depends on how many you have. I'll let you use all of them if you want. You just don't get them back until the next long rest. I only get one, but I got eight. So yeah. You should have... You're one D8. You should yeah, have... Yeah, but where do you get multiple? are you? Oh, I don't know. Four? four. I'm, oh, four. we might you have, have four. four. I should have four hit dice? Mm-hmm. What? Oh, one for each one for each level. Oh, okay. Well then, Mike I'm gonna, has I'm four twelve. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna use two of them at least. Just heal up a little bit. Nine. That's seventeen. That puts me at thirty-two. I'll. I'll I'm good with that. Do I'll, we I'll have the erasers? Uh, you can use mine. If I you had want. them. Ah, you are the best. My pencil. Oh eraser. no, no. Like oh, the... they're behind uh, Mike. I saw Michael. them earlier. Michael. Selfish, selfish, Michael. Very selfish. He used it before when I requested it. 
What a rude man. Well, now I have two. Uh, whoa. Those are mine. I should get one. Bastards. I just gave you one. Shit. Yeah, exactly. Okay, cool. I went up 16, so now I'm at 30 out of 38. I believe in a thing called love. There's also the river in my heart. So yeah, Gray's just kind of like, while you guys are doing that, he's just kind of scribbling on a piece of paper. And uh, you see him, and he's slowly, he's pacing back and forth, and then he's trying. You see him kind of do, like, the Doctor Strange thing, trying to make another, excuse me, another portal. And you see it, like, flicker, and then it just goes, fuck. Doing a really good job there. Shut up. How about that? Doing so good. Cool. Oh, great. I, I love how supportive you are. Of yeah, me. I'm trying. You want to move away? Just hear that arena let's, together. Let's go to. Let's go away together. Let's go. Let's run away. Let's cut the sexual tension in half, bro. Yeah, let's do it. Come run with me. Let's fly on Fuck. to Peru. Oh my god, those were so wrong. <laughs> those words were not right. I sang it the way I sang it, and I meant it. Damn it. <laughs> my so, performance is bad. <laughs> so Gray does this like kind of like circuit of him trying to open another plane. It crackling out, him picking up his axes, throwing them at a tree, taking them off, putting them down, doing the, like, he starts doing this. Like, this is, I guess, how his way of how he thinks. He has two short throwing axes that he th he's throwing at this tree. And every time you see it, it hits in the same place. Like, dunk, dunk. What's the, um, what's with the axes? I have to defend myself, right? <laughs> From a tree? That's how I think. Don't you, I don't know, twiddle your thumbs or jump rope. I don't know what halflings do, no offense, but this is how I think. They steal stuff. Yeah, that's that's pretty, well, that's just me. Yeah, I know. <laughs> just making that known. <sighs> Fuck! So. Do you want me to throw the axe? <laughs> would you like to throw the axe? I would like to throw the axe. And he hands you these axes, and they're super intricate looking. Like, they have all of these elven runes on it, and it just looks re They're just super sharp, really nice, and yeah, you can go ahead, roll, uh, I think, to throw it. It's uh, roll a d20, see if you hit the tree. 16? I would say you hit. You hit. It's satisfying, like, one hits, and then you can keep doing that if you'd like. Four. Four. <laughs> the next one just goes. Vroom, 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 vroom. And it, it just goes past the trees. Like, you're going to get that. Dirt. <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't tell the child to get it. No. You get it. Okay. I go to get it. Okay, so <laughs> as he's going back and forth, and he keeps, like, between hitting the tree, kind of hitting the tree, skimming past it, and you're basically just fang playing fetch with yourself while injured. <laughs> How long have you, have you guys been in Barovia for? Uh, Probably about a, a week and a half yeah, now. a week and a half. Week and a half. Oh, jeez. Closer to two, maybe. It's really hard to tell time here. <laughs> it is. There's no sun. Um, you seen the castle, right? Uh, you didn't. I. <laughs> they saw the castle. Why? Where were you? Uh, fell off a mountain. <laughs> I caught him. <laughs> you big old clunky guy. <laughs> and uh, he's still <laughs> scribbling, and then he gets his paper and he starts scribbling again. What are you writing? <laughs> oh, nothing. I'm just drawing something. What are you drawing? So, <laughs> I have to, you're just throwing axes. What are you drawing? <laughs> it's a wolf. Would you like it? Um, so, it's you in a werewolf form. It's you in werewolf form. <laughs> Shouldn't have saved your ass. So, he starts drawing out, and he's drawing this big, as you see, this big intricate map. And as he's looking at you, you see that he doesn't need to even look at you as he's drawing it. Like, he's done it so many times before. And he goes... Every time I go into a new plane, I have to redraw this so I can re-get my bearings. And uh, he's you see him drawing, like, we're in Barovia. Barovia is, like, outside of just the regular realm. It's, it's in this weird pocket dimension. I don't know if you've noticed, but no one can leave Barovia. They've said that. Unless you're Vistani. Why? Why can the Vistani leave? They're, like, cursed or they're blessed or something. Like, I don't fucking know. They never tell me anything. They just curse me every fucking time. Cool. Yeah. Wait, what kind of curse? Oh, uh, there was this one time I couldn't tie my shoes really well. Every time I did it, I just kept, like, my hands. I didn't have the motor f skill function to do it. That's cool. Just, I'm I mean, gonna I can't do that anyways. I got fat hands. <laughs> I, got, I got sausage fingers. <laughs> what are you rolling for? 
Hitting the tree. Oh, hitting the tree. <laughs> You're doing an all right job. How are you doing? I just got a two. So <laughs> you did not do good. I got another two. Okay, give me give me my act. Get, 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 I got another two. No. <laughs> <laughs> give me the... Yank some from you. Put some back. Okay, no more throwing axes. Great. I got to find some throwing Arguably, axes. he wasn't throwing them. He was just kind of chucking them. Yeah. I got a two. He just what? keeps dropping them. You want my hand axes? Yeah. <laughs> Too bad. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that I last mean, one was a 12. Never mind. Before I was outside of this, even this realm, I was in the Feywild, and uh, it's, just, it's a nightmare there. That's always fun, but it was a lot nicer than this place. At least there's sun and birds. There's birds. We have, uh, we have ravens. Almost exclusively ravens. I just, <clears throat> yeah. And wolves. Those are not birds. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I thought we were talking about animals in general. My bad. My favorite's the... Giraffe. Um, <laughs> a little giraffe bird. Little wolf cubs are adorable. A little angry, but they're cute. Little wolf cubs? Like yeah. you've been fighting puppies? Yeah, pretty much. Just been killing puppies? No. Well, they attack. He's so. dumb. He's, he's dumb. Yeah, I could see that. Yeah. Well, they're tiny. He's dumb. That's fair. Ugh. <sighs> The boy is so, probably the smartest one we have part of the group, to be honest with you. I'm not a boy. The boy. Him? Yeah, I'm not talking yeah, I'm not about boy, him. But I'm the smartest, Dirt's so. like, hello. <laughs> He's probably the smartest one we got. Oh, no. He has no guts. Yeah, no. It's not good. I have more than enough guts. I'll have you know. Didn't I hear you throwing up? Like, yeah. Hands in your pockets, kid. <laughs> I mean, you see him and he slowly puts his hands in his pockets. So uh, so what's the what's the sitch here? What are, where are we heading? The Kali. We're on our way to take Irene in there to meet with the abbot. Oh, okay. Yeah, dope. Dope. Why does that not sound dope? When you say <laughs> that, I feel not dope about no, it. No, no, that's that's probably a good idea. You should probably avoid, you know, things along the way. You probably want to go straight shot because, you know, distractions are what he does. Uh, what? It's him. It's Strahd. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, like, like what? kind of distractions I mean he's probably been fucking with you like this whole time right we think so you think so we think so okay has he what makes you think so uh well god I'm dumb apparently so I don't know I feel like you're really hurt by that it's okay bud a little bit right champ it's okay it's okay to be dumb uh it's better than being unconscious we had an interaction with what seemed to be my body hanging from a tree. Oh, classic. Yeah, what? Huh? Classic? Yeah. Oh, yes. yeah, I've done that all the, all the time. <clears throat> he no, that he does you? that, like, all the time. He can just fucks you, with you. Can you sense other... Uh, can you sense magical properties in things, or...? I mean, I can sense other, uh, other planes. Uh, I can sense gates to other planes. What about, like, dark magic? Kinda. So, I have a, a hunch. Mm. And just curious as to whether or not you can help me figure out if my hunch is correct. What's the hunch? Uh, I think Strahd uh, went into uh, our friend's brain. And uh, gave him a necklace, and that's how he's tracking us. Wait, which one? That one. You? The dumb one. The dumb one? Yeah. There's a lot of space. Can I see the necklace? Yeah. Is the, Are you going to hurt me? <laughs> Just don't break it. I mean, Or I break it. If it's bad, break it. Okay. And you see him, you and he kind of... couldn't have discussed this with me beforehand? No. Trouble at home? Maybe. I'm just fucking with you. And you see him, and he takes it. And he's just kind of looking at it. And he looks back at you. And he's like, did you make this? I mean, if I did, I was sleeping when I did it. Mm. Uh, I don't know if that's you or whatever fur is on this. It seems all right. Thank you. He gives it back to him. Dick. I mean, it seems okay. I don't... I mean, Strahd gives people gifts. I don't I don't foresee him giving a gift that looks, no offense, so crudely made like a child made it. Fair. It's for my brother. He's a wolf. That's a, a story. Yeah, we're... This guy's serious? 
we're a weird bunch. No. <laughs> <laughs> Spoilers. What? Spoilers. Jesus. So, uh, going to Vakali. How far is Vakali from here, do you think? If you uh, had to guesstimate. I have no idea where I am. Sweet. Us either. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, give me kind of like a general, and you see him take out a different piece of parchment, and he kind of goes, all right, sh- tell me where you've kind of been. Uh, we were in the town of Barovia. Oh, so the village? Yes. That one. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, okay, we were okay. there. We've gone to the Vistani camp. And you see him start, like, sh- 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 I don't know what that is. Okay. Uh, we were at uh, a waterfall where there was also a bridge uh, off to... Oh, to... that's by the castle. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we, we see him. We... we passed the castle on our way here. How long ago did you pass the castle? <sighs> I was unconscious. You were I don't knocked know. out. Uh, Absidy. I, think, I don't think. It I don't know what's saltier, ago. the waterfall, you or you. It's a mixture. Well, waterfall is is fresh water, so it wouldn't be salty. Burn a joke. <laughs> Let me oh, just have it. Yeah. Let me okay. just have it. You're right. You're funny. Thank smart. You. Thanks. Thank yeah. you. So how long and ago? Do you and think, pretty. I mean, oh, it. You. <laughs> it was. We passed the castle today. I yeah, and then we slept, and then we got attacked. So, so it couldn't here have been we that. are. You guys just left the. Okay, so you're like, I'd say you're about two weeks out. Weeks? That is far. Yeah. I thought Vakali was close to the castle. No. No. I, I, I'm legitimate. That's outside of the, I thought it was closer. That's my bad. It's not. Okay. It's on it's like not. the opposite side of the map. It's not. Yeah. It's like in the middle of the map. Not even the middle. It's, uh, it's my bad. You, you guys got a ways to go. <laughs> I was going to say, I, I haven't seen the map since I have, in like a couple we weeks. We have horses. So. Does that help? I mean, it's going to shorten it to two weeks. If you were on foot, it'd take a lot longer. I saw the horses. I kind of deduced... Ah, deduce. I'm like that. <laughs> Shut up, I had Josh. an idea. <laughs> what? Who's Josh? Ding. <laughs> okay. And you see him. He draws this like crude map, and I'm gonna. I'll make it for you later. That just basically shows you where we are. Where you are, and he's gonna go. Okay, so Vakali or Velaki. I don't remember these weird Barovian names because they're dumb. Oh, okay. And, you know, despite no being here so many fucking times. Okay, let's let's look here. <clears throat> okay, so you're at the village. Did you pass a body of water? Yes. Okay. Okay. The so there's the pool. There's the falls. You're and then you said you passed the gate with uh, the castle, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So okay, so you're gonna want to avoid that. Okay. Wait. Yeah. Avoid what? And then you're gonna. This is not important. Um. It feels maybe important. Maybe just believe in me. Okay. Okay. Here we Have are. Have I steered you wrong yet? I haven't given you, you know a chance for to. Four <clears throat> minutes. It's. Uh, I, I would like to say it's maybe a solid thirty. We had that interaction. We connected. It was great. I, I don't know. He's it. kind of a dick. I like him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I am. <laughs> yeah, you do. I am. Um. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it's what I said. I mean, you're you're <laughs> you're a while away. You're about two weeks out, man. What if you Did you pack jerky or snacks? I do yes. have rations. <laughs> what kind of, uh, yeah. Do you know if there's any like villages along the way that we'd be able to stop at? Uh no. No. Can you do that circle thing you do? Great. What circle thing? The whoosh, with the axe, the thing that you couldn't do with the axe, and then I threw the axe and I did a real good job for someone my size. And then you do the hand thing and you come through the portal. Oh, you want me to make another portal? Yeah. I can't. Why? Because I've been trying to because I want to get away from you guys. But we'll just go That's with fair. you. That's No. <laughs> I want to get out of this plane. No, we're friends now. What's my name? Anthony. Gray. Anthony Gray. Yes, I know. It's not. It's not. You don't listen. Granthony. Granthony? I was asleep. You were not asleep. You were fully awake looking at me when I said my name. Almost turning to into be a fair, To be fair, you could have been delirious. And, you know... Okay, so yeah, I'll have to I'll have to draw that. So, boys, you guys you guys fucked up those werewolves because I see the bodies. Because you guys did you guys put the bodies away? No. <laughs> are they just scattered around? <laughs> oh, they're just yeah. Scattered. So they're, they're around. so the werewolves are just kind of around. Yeah, I mean I'm maintaining eye contact because I'm kind of grossed out by all the entrails everywhere. Sorry, you know. Sniff it. No, dude. I don't want to sniff it. Come on. It's it's good. S- take a whiff. <laughs> sniff my finger. <laughs> so you guys are pretty competent, huh? Uh, I mean, barely. Barely? From time to time. 
We have our moments. You have your moments? Yeah. Okay. Um, I like slashing things. So. You like sla- how yeah. how good are your like reflexes? I would say they're pretty good. They're pretty good. You yeah. would say they're would you say they're pretty fair? And then while he talks to you, he takes one of the axes and he throws it at Chart. See, I would like to see if I hit you. <laughs> nope. Do I roll it just, a, I was gonna say, do I have goes, to roll a dodge foo, foo, or anything? <laughs> fuck! Can't blame a guy for trying. And he throws the other one. Does an eighteen hit? Do I have an opportunity to roll an athletics check to dodge? No. <laughs> Why? Because you're tra- checking my reflexes. Yeah, I, I am checking your reflex. All right, go ahead, try to dodge. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> you kind of see this axe just leave his his left hand, and it uh, it kind of sticks into the short's chest, and it you get like one point of slashing damage as you go. The fuck. <laughs> the fuck. What? I gotta test you guys. If you're gonna try to fight a giant vampire, I gotta know that you guys are doing a good job, right? Yeah. Uh, sure. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so he's gonna he's gonna punch you towards the face. Okay. That doesn't hit. Damn it. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Everyone roll initiative. Oh god damn it. This isn't what I was expecting. I thought we were friends. You're friends. So we just got. It's a friendly jaunt. Kill him as friends. <laughs> We wouldn't kill him. I mean, he's a revenant, so he's gonna come back. So okay, uh, anyone get over uh, twenty? Um, y- no. <laughs> Fifteen or higher. Nineteen. Nineteen. <clears throat> Ooh, Absinthe and Shard. Their initiative's a plus three. Nice. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's dope. And then what'd you get, Pat? Thirteen. And Rufio is last. Okay, so we're gonna just do kind of like a crude in the in the. Spirit of the mind kind okay. of thing, okay? No battle map? I mean, I don't. My battle map's right there. Oh, okay, yeah, we could do a battle map. We can always just grab the uh, the half table. Yeah, give me the half table. Good thing I made this. I'm so smart and great. <laughs> You're all right. Josh you said, uh, <laughs> Tell me I'm, pretty. I'm, I'm so happy pretty. I made God, this. Thanks. I'm so smart and great. <laughs> For those of you that can't hear. I'll switch it to the battle map. Battle map away! Battle map. Here, sick. So, you're kind of here. He's next to you. Sure, you're kind of over here. And then I'm gonna he that. has no axes. He did throw it. Does he, need axes? he threw bow. Does he need axes? You just said he doesn't, so I'm going to guess no. We'll find out. It's just important to know that because I kept missing, he now doesn't have the axes. So I helped. He threw the mic and missed. One of them is in Damn Mike's it. chest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm probably going to take that out. <laughs> Throw it back. No, I was going to say, I pretty you... much already took it out. and kind of. <laughs> no, now you have a new axe. I mean, yeah, I'll pick it up later and use it. I don't know. Okay. I already have two hand axes. Okay, so. so oh, true. <laughs> Absidy, you're up. Oh, me first? Uh... You know what? You two roll at the same time, and we'll see who gets to go first amongst the two of you, unless you want to decide. Okay. What do you get? Eight. A six. Okay, so... Oh, no, great. <laughs> get this out of the way now. That's not I an mean, attack roll. Wait, you just go first. It makes more sense for you to go first. Oh, yeah, you're right. That does make sense. Okay, so first motion is yep. to get close, which, I mean, based on the sure. normal layout, it looks like okay. I, I can get close enough to do that. Mm-hmm. Okay, so now we are flanking him, so I have advantage when flanked. Um, no, you're within flanked. five feet, though. So he has advantage regardless, yeah. but he's not flanked. Yeah, oh. flanked has to be complete opposite side. Yeah. Opposite <coughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But you're you're fine. I need more dice. Okay, so that is a 21. 21 hits. Uh, seven. Seven? Okay, seven points. Yep. All right. <clears throat> you kind of, like... Reel back. What are you using? Gray, uh, Great axe. Yeah. So you're like, family. And it just kind of scrapes across his back. He's like, okay, cool. Awesome. And then, uh, Absidy, you're up. Okay. I'm going to come on up here. Hazoo. Hazoo. <laughs> Huzzah. And uh, I'm going to do, do a little sneak attack with my rapier. Okay. 13 plus 5. 13 hits. Or 15, 18, whatever. Hits. 18. 18. Yeah. So I need my D8. D- can I have another D6? Yeah. <coughs> oh, wait, I, I have a. I have you have one. one? Yeah. Okay. I'm good. Use your metal dice, bro. Uh, 10. 10? 10, 10 points? Plus your sneak attack? 
No, that is with that, the, the, the oh, sneak attack. It's, it's two d sixes. Okay, it. so that's seventeen right before his turn. Nice. Okay, <laughs> and you see Gray, and he kind of goes, "Okay, all right." And then oh, as you're, yeah, it lo- is thir- it's thirteen. It's thirteen. Yeah. Okay. So as you look at him, got you, girl. Uh, so what? That's nineteen. Twenty. Twenty points. Oh, yeah. Because I'm not raging right now. That sense. Okay. <clears throat> as you look at him, he's just kind of like you see him crick his neck, and you see the the what you call it the wound slowly healing. As they slowly close, and he goes, "Okay, uh, so bye." And you see him go, Voom. and he pops. And a moment, you're just kind of like, "Okay, great." Uh, what? And you see him pop up over here, and he picks up his axe, oh, and he goes, "Cool." Voom. And so he's gonna go ahead and throw his axe at Shart. Does a does a 14 hit? Yep. Okay, cool. Barely. Barely. <clears throat> Barely's barely. Okay, so you take uh, 13 points of slashing damage. Oof. Damn. It was literally one last turn. <laughs> <laughs> he, didn't, he didn't roll high. Uh, he didn't wow. rage either. Yeah, no, I'm going to rage now. <laughs> and he goes, that was a good hit. I thought it was a good hit. What did you guys think? <laughs> Yeah. Rufio, you're up. Fuck you. Uh, I'm going to unsheath Mongo's Claymore. Oh, he's taking out the big guns. And uh, I'm going to charge at... What's his face? At Gray? Yeah. I'm going to call him Purple just to disrespect him a little bit. Just to disrespect... (laughs) Yeah. I don't know if you know this, but Purple's my favorite color. (laughs) He's saying as you're like, I'm going to get you, Purple. Uh, It's a 15. 15 hits. Let's fuck shit up. We're going to do it now. Uh, f- uh, 8, 10 plus 2 bleed is 12. So 12? Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, okay. And then, uh, yeah, it's back to Shark. What about Dirt? Dirt's not gonna. Dirt's not. Dirt's just kind of like, what the fuck? <laughs> and Irina's like, he started it. Hands are still in his pockets. And Irina is just like, you boys are ridiculous. He started it. Are you raging? <coughs> yeah, I raged. Mm-hmm. Ooh, he's a big fella. What'd you get? Uh, uh, eight. Eight. So eight points ca- of damage. Eight, eight points, points of damage. Of damage. Yeah. So what'd you? What would you? Uh, I rolled a uh, twenty-one. Okay. Yeah. So I know that hits. Okay. Just let me know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. You get excited. I mm. I know. I got into it. That's okay. I like when you guys get into it. So you kind of go back, and then you're just like, okay. So you, this big slash goes across his chest. He's like, this is my favorite cloak. Yeah, deal with it. You threw a fucking axe at me. I mean, you're doing a great job. Absidy, you're up. Hey, yeah, I think we're doing pretty well. You're doing all right. No, we're doing pretty well. <laughs> I come up here. Okay. Going to do sneak attack, rapier. Uh, 19. 19 hits. Sneak attack with my rapier. Uh, four, five, four, it's eight, 13, 13 plus, plus three, 16. 16? Nice. Okay. Thanks, dog. And you see him, and you're just like, and he's like, ow. And then Sorry. it is, and then you slowly, as you take it out, you start sealing the thing starting to heal over. Like, he doesn't bleed because he has no blood circulation, but you start seeing it start to close together, and he's like, all right, this isn't, this is funny. This is fun. This is great. You're sticking me like a, a pit. Picks up his other axe, and he goes, "Okay, cool." And uh, who's looking at him? No one. No one right now. Oh, no one's. Uh... <laughs> he went behind us. So. Okay. And then he's gonna hold his his action. Okay. So that means you're up. <sighs> okay. Um. I'm gonna charge at okay. him again. So as you start charging at him, he looks at you, and you see this glint in his eye just change, like slowly from his greenish pale uh, eyes to this uh, red. I need you to make a uh, wisdom saving throw. Uh, that's a thirteen. Okay. So as you start going over, you your body suddenly stops, and it goes. And you were paralyzed. Sick. So you're halfway, I'd say you're halfway to before you get paralyzed. Zo. And you see him smirk and shart, you're up. 
My turn. Yep. Wisdom saving throw too? No. Or no? Okay. He's waiting. But now I'm not within five feet, so I'm not at, at Correct. advantage. Okay. Unless you want a reckless, then he'll have advantage on no, you. No, I'm not doing that. <laughs> okay. I missed. Okay. So you kind of go out and you're like, oh, that's fucked up. And he just kind of sidesteps you. You see him with the two axes go, kink, kink. He's only got one axe. One's no, still no, in my back. Up another one. One. But the other one's in my back. No, you no, threw, you it, threw out. it down. Yeah. No, I threw the one that was well, in my chest down. Right. And the other one, he missed he you. He missed with, you. And with. he picked it up. Yeah. So he has the, his He's two got I know, but then he threw a second one at my back. No, he, no, he threw, threw one the, at you and He threw missed. the first one. He threw the other up, one in your chest. The other one. You threw the one out of your chest. So he's got both now. He's got both. <clears throat> no, that, that he doesn't has two. make sense. He has two. He definitely does. It doesn't make sense, though. That's the thing. It, it does. Because he threw one at me before the fight started. Yeah, and, and then so threw that one out. No, no, no. He he, so he missed. He threw it he two missed times. the first one. Yeah. He threw two. So the first one was over there, and then the second one was in your chest, and you threw it to the side. So he went there first, picked that one, and then he teleported to where the other one is and picked it up. Yeah, but then he threw the second one at my back, and that one hit. Did so I, he only has did one he throw axe. it again? Yeah. Okay, so he has one axe. Thank you. That's fine. <laughs> okay, so... Prove the DM wrong. <laughs> and so, Absidy, it's your turn. Okay. I'm uh, going to run up. Boop. So sneak he attack. just kind of goes like, he puts it to his forearm, and he kind of tink. So sneak attack, go ahead. Yep, sneak attack. Ooh. Five. So you're kind of like, ho-ho, and Wait, you go. Wait, can I, I can re-roll that. If you want. luck. You have lucky. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll luck it. Thirteen. Thirteen hits. Sneak attack. Good call, good call. Uh, eight, eleven, plus three, fourteen. Okay. And then... I hide. Yeah. At this yeah. point, I don't think hiding is really going to be beneficial. <laughs> He's like, bitch. <laughs> and so he, um, he's going to go. I just, <sighs> one second. And then this is where he threw the axe. Would you say? Because you're over here. Yeah, it's about there. Okay. So he kind of picks up the axes again. He picks up the second one. He's like, this is my favorite axe. And he goes up to uh, to Rufio, and he's gonna he's gonna smack you while you're, you're paralyzed. I'll I'll be here with his two axes. So, duh. Oh, it's at advantage because you're paralyzed. Okay. Okay. So. Okay. Hey. Okay, that's. So does his armor class not matter for this? No, it does. He critted. <laughs> yeah. That's what I figured happened. On both of them? He critted on one, and then the other one he got an 18 on. Mm. So They both hit. Gotcha. <laughs> you took a, you take about uh, 15 points of slashing damage, and your paralysis is gone, though. Yeah. But you see him, and he takes the two axes, and he goes, junk, junk. Okay, now we got to fight, right? And now, Rufio, you're up. Hey, at least you only got, you know... 15, I got 14 off of one. He hit you by twice. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I'll turn around and I will uh, use Mongo's Claymore and I'll take a pretty Wait. hearty swing. <coughs> Whale on his titties. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> it's like kinked between an 18 you can, and a You two. can roll it again. Makes me sad. I wanted just... the 18. <laughs> That's a 17 plus 17 hits. Or whatever. Uh, okay, so let's do this again. I'm going to reroll this one for attack damage. Sure. Yeah, yeah, you got a great weapon. Okay. 7, 13 plus 2 is 15. Okay, so 15? Yeah. Okay. Uh, ch -ch 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 -ch. And you just, you wail into him and you just chop a good chunk and it sinks into his clavicle and he just kind of looks at you like you don't see any pain register across his face. He's just like, ow, that really like, you guys are fucking up my cloak. I'm just kidding. I'll find a new one. <laughs> And he kind of just starts shaking it out as uh, Shart, you're up. Okay, I'm going to get closer to attack, but you should... He needs cloaks. You're a guy for that. I, have, I do have many cloaks. Maybe oh we can God. defend him with cloaks. <laughs> okay, if I give you cloaks, I'll give you two cloaks if we stop fighting. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you can just give me one and we can keep fighting. <laughs> Three and we stop fighting. <laughs> you're just going to give me all your cloaks? I No, I need one for myself. Oh, little guy. Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> I tried. You did. It was a good try. Okay, so that was a 15, so that'll hit, but I'm at advantage, so... Okay, 15. Well, 20. Okay, that's... I mean, that hits. Go ahead. 
that fell out of my thing. Uh, that is nine, eleven. Eleven? Okay. Yeah. Once again, it's more of the same where it just kind of, you're just slashing at him and he just, he doesn't even look annoyed. He looks genuinely like enthused. Like he's just really excited right now. He's like, you guys are doing like such a great job. Okay, little guy. Come on. Come on. Uh, okay. You see him twirl the two axes in his hands. Yeah, so I run up to the side. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I'm just kidding. I know where you are. Ooh, I th do I get advantage when it's flanked? He's technically flanked. I would say so. Don't. Unless you want to get on the other side. You'll be on the other side of him. Well, this would... Yeah. Yep. Uh, okay. So 15. 15? Uh, that's damage or... No, hit? that's... um. That's... Your roll. To hit. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. That hits. Sneak attack. 10. Plus th four, 14. 14. And as my bonus action, I take an arrow and the little little like gap yeah. of the slash, I stick it in there. So when it heals up, he's got an arrow coming out of him. Okay, so you're just like, and he's like, why did you, why did you, and you see the gash close in around the arrow and he just goes, bing. Do, 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 do. <laughs> you just stick an arrow in me? Yeah. Not consent. <laughs> <laughs> okay, something tells me he's going to attack you. <laughs> How much any uh, pops? HP do you have? <laughs> Twenty-eight. Okay. And he pops up behind you. and Goes. That's a bad halfling. And so he's gonna kick you. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know. Okay. And uh, the first one definitely misses. <laughs> okay. And you see him, and he kind of like slips a little bit in the mud. And he's like, "Fuck!" And you see him like not really lift up his leg, but he just kind of goes. Poof. Just sticks his leg out, and you get uh, three points of bludgeoning damage as you fall forward prone. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> you fell forward. <clears throat> <laughs> Can you hand me the... the what, how does prone work? So you have to use your uh, half of your movement to get up. Okay, but it's not an action, right? It's... No, it's okay. just your movement to get up. Okay. Uh, Rufio, you're up. Uh, I'll charge at him again with, uh, with Mongo. Okay. Where'd it? you get that? That's really cool. I killed a thing for it. You killed a thing? I've killed things before, and I usually don't get trophies for it, but usually I try to kill them, and then I get things from them, and he's, I'm sorry, I'm rolling. I'm just, I'm just excited. Uh, I want to... Fo I rolled a uh, modded 17. Okay. I want to try and, like, hit cheek so we can, like, sever the jaw a little bit, see if we can make him stop talking. Stop talking? Yeah, okay. a little bit. Okay, just a Go little ahead. bit. Uh, eight, ten, twelve, uh, twelve. Yeah, yeah. yeah. 12. Okay, so you kind of like go and you sink in, and it just goes, Kunk! and it goes halfway through his mouth, and he's like, arr, 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 arr. Come on, shark, you're up. <clears throat> Once again, mildly annoyed. Yeah. Well, I want to get him a little. It's a seventeen plus five is a twenty-two. Okay. Okay. That's kinked. Uh, that is a 16. 16? Yep. Okay. 16 points. Uh, Absidy? Mm -hmm. Are you going to use half of your movement to get up? I am. <laughs> what? <laughs> and then I'm going to step into Rufio Square and attack, which I can oh. do because I'm little. Oh. Sneak attack. 19. 19 hits. <laughs> You're right, bud. <laughs> It's a rough day for Josh. I'm okay. Did well, though. Uh, 12, 17, mm -hmm. 20. 20 points of damage? Damn. Yeah, okay. I don't give a heck. And you Respect. see it, and you just you just sink up, and it just goes up to his throat, and you see the tip of uh, Absidy's rapier just kind of go up, because you figured he's just a giant pincushion at this yeah. point. Yeah. And so you see him, and he's just kind of like, uh, uh. And thunk. God damn it. Where's it going? Behind us. Not yet. Where does he want to go? And so you see him pop up, and then he sits. He's sitting next to Irina, and his jaw is back in, and you see things closing up. And he goes, ah, they're really brutal. I mean, that, was, that wasn't really polite and nice. And ah, I just, I'm honestly, I came out to have a good time, and I'm feeling personally attacked right now. And Irina's like, you're a big douchebag. And he goes, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so what are you doing after this? <laughs> and she's like, she kind of just scrunches up over there and he looks over and earlier when you saw Rufio, his eyes turned into this amber 
when he uh, zeroed in on one of the werewolves. You see his eyes, and he locks eyes with Chart, and you see his eyes slowly go to that amber. And he goes, all right, I guess we'll, I guess we'll try this. And you see him throw his, uh, his uh, axes again at Chart. Both of them? Yes. Does it 18 hit? Yeah. And there's the second one. Does it 17 hit? Yeah. Okay. Oh, you you have 18. I have okay. 18. Yeah, my armor class is 18. What's I your know. bonus? Your your um, unarmored bonus. Oh, uh, he'd be a 14. Oh, and 14. you're raging, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so you take 18 points of damage, half to nine. nine. As these two axes just go thunk thunk, and he's like, "I'm gonna get those later. Just hold on to them for me, okay? <laughs> just hold on to them, and then I'll just I'm just talking to your lady here." So. The thing about plane walking is, <laughs> and so, uh, Rufio, it's, it's your turn. So uh, he's all the way here. I'm going to cast Hunter's Mark okay. on him. And, he's like, I feel like I've seen this before. And uh, he's too far for me to use to, to move for Mongo, right? Correct. Yeah. Okay, so I'm, I'll move as far up as I can. Okay. And then throw a, a, a javelin. You're going to throw a javelin yeah. while he's next to Irina? Yeah. Okay. I feel confident in my abilities. Sure. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to hit him. Hopefully. <laughs> and not Irina. Hopefully. <laughs> I'm sorry. I lay on hands. It's fine. Oh, that's oh, not going to do it. That's you. an eight. So he's like, you pull back and you go javelin and it just it goes vroom, and he starts to veer off and you see uh gray kind of go dunk, and he catches it and he's like dude don't throw things <laughs> that's rude and irena like the blade is like right next to irena's temple and he's like come on dude like you're trying to just be cool dude <laughs> and he puts the the javelin actually he holds the javelin and he's just sitting there so shart you're up <clears throat> i mean i'm close to dead now so i'm down to seven um I mean, the most that I can do... Uh, where's Irina? In, Irina's right next to, like, to Gray. Here? So I would say here. I don't want to throw anything at him. So. I'll come to you. Like, it's cool. Yeah, I was going to say, uh, I'm going to... You're looking a little a little winded there. I don't want to I don't want to kill you. I'm not winded, but I'm you just, look a little, I'm a little roughed like, up. You're like, not winded. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little bit roughed up, all right? Two axes I've sticking out of his supplements. chest. <laughs> I'm, taking, I'm taking some, you know, whey protein. So he's like, a whole lot more than whey protein. Because <laughs> you yes. feel no pain. <laughs> and he's just kind of sitting there, and he's like, you? Um, well, I would never shoot at Irina, because I'm a better guy. Dude, he's getting it in. So. And so he's like, okay. And so if you want to hold your attack action as well, because he'll yeah, come back into range. I'll do, I'm going to do my, um, fuck, what's it called? The thing where when something ha I, ah, I read your reaction. Yeah, reaction. Yeah. So if so, he comes near me, I'm going to move away. Okay, so that's going to be your, your hold action to basically just j dodge and move out of the way. Yeah. Are, are you still right next to me? Um, yeah. I, mean, uh, I was going to hide behind you. but you can that hide would, behind him and then but, he'll get the, the advantage for it. Okay, yeah. So I'll hide behind him. And that. then if he comes to my side, I then hide on the other side. <laughs> okay, great. Chart. Dude, I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> You're well, not a good friend. <laughs> and so it's back to Grace turn. He's like, so what's your deal? Like, you know, you want to, like, get out of here or something? And she's like, please stop talking to me. And he goes, all right. I mean, fair enough. And he gets up and uh, he goes, I just, uh, I kind of, uh, yeah, all right. And he kind of gets up to, uh, to Rufio and he squares up with the javelin and he uses it kind of like a bow staff. Cool. So only one end is going to be speared. That's kind of dope. That was cocked. Okay, it does a 19 hit? Yes. Okay. And, okay, the second one misses. So does, he kind of hooks down, and it hits you in the gut for... Does that count as improvised weapon? I would say so. So it's less powerful, so he's safe. <laughs> Looking out for you. So you take four points of bludgeon damage as he tries to go over with the, the spearhead, but he miscalculated and thought you would, like, sink down. Yeah. Or he didn't calculate for you to sink down, so he pops back up, and he's like, aw. Uh, it's your turn. I want to come up from the ground uh, with Mongo. Yeah. Straight up the chest. Dude, stabbing me with the chest again? Uh, 17. That hits. And I also have Hunter's Mark, which so is an another... D6? <clears throat> yes. 
Uh, how many times am I allowed to re-roll a one? Is that is it one time per long rest I think or is so. it okay? Uh, six, ten, eleven, thirteen. Thirteen. Oh, like that's not a good hit. Uh, it could have been a better hit. Shut up. <laughs> okay, and you see him, and it kind of goes, vroom, and you see it stick out from the back of him. And, uh, Shark, it's your turn. He's uh, like, don't worry, Sunshine, I'm coming. I'm just trying to, I'm kind of stuck at the moment. Get it? Because he has his thing in me. Ha. That's what you're trying to do. I mean, I can't get close enough to attack with my axe, so. And right now, he doesn't have his axes. No, they're he still in your. Cl- they're still no, in your, I, I, no, I didn't. Pu- I didn't yes. fucking pull them out. Yeah, uh, <laughs> but he has the javelin now. Yeah. Okay. So he still has the javelin. Um, yeah. I mean, I can't really hold do your any- action for attack. Yeah. Hold my action. I really okay. can't do anything from here. You're good, man. You can do okay. a uh, a reaction thing. Yeah, that's what his his holding is going to be for. So if he gets in the vicinity, then you can then you can attack Mike. Oh, okay. Okay. So that's what it'll I be. I thought you had to say it beforehand. I. That's what I'm assuming he wants to do. I'm yeah. just asking questions. Yeah, that so, uh, Absidy, you're up. Okay. If you want to do the same thing, basically. Uh, no. So okay. Irina is back there. Back here. Yep. So I will come to this side, and I'm going to shoot with the short bow. Okay. Which also counts as a sneak attack. Sure. Mm, Twelve. Twelve. And so you see it, and it kind of just goes. It slick backs. It's uh, it kind of sneaks up on him, and you see it kind of shave the side of his head slow, like a little bit, and you see a gash kind of open up. Nice haircut. Thank you. I uh, I thought I would go with like tri tribal kind of thing. I thought it'd be interesting. Did you know there's actually a tribe in? Th- and he kind of comes back up, and he kind of, he's at Shart, and you see him put both of his feet are on Shart's shoulders, and he puts his hands on the axes. So I'm gonna give you an attack reaction to see if you can grab him. Okay. So go ahead and roll a strength check for me. Good, because you're strong. You are strong. You're a big strong man. Big strong. So wait, uh, strength check. That's not a saving throw. That's no, just my four that's over here. Yep. Mm, Fourteen. Fourteen. Well, well, do I get do I get a proficiency bonus on that or no? No. Just on the saving throw. Right. Okay. Okay. So you, he comes up to you and he's like, "Hi." Uh, he's still talking from the last one. And when they do like this kind of like weird kind of thing with smoke, and then they have a spirit quest, and Short's like, "Shut the fuck up!" And you kind of try to grab him on his sides, and he starts taking out the axes, and you crush him a little bit, and he just starts struggling, struggling, and he slowly because you're so weak from the fatigue of the the fight before, and him shoving axes into you. And he's like, "Okay, I'm gonna." I'm going to move now. And he kind of kicks off your chest and he flips back and he's in between you two now. I think this has been a great learning experience. Uh, I don't know if you want to continue, but uh, yeah, I can keep going if you want. What is even the purpose of all this right now? I got to see if you're ready. If I'm going to be annoying, do you think he's going to not be annoying? Fair. (laughs) (laughs) Thank you. And you see him and he goes, boom. And he throws an axe at you, uh, Rufio. Good. <laughs> Good. He lives there then. <laughs> he lives there then. Uh, 17 does not hit. It does okay, not. Okay, so you see it go think, and it just chinks off his arm, and it sticks in front of Irina. It was a good job there. Irina, hang on to that. <laughs> you know, I'm just, I'm trying. I'm trying really hard. I just want to impress my new friends. And he throws the other axe at uh, Absidy. Yeah, it's cocked. Uh, does a 15 hit? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you take three points of slashing damage. Oh as it, no! As it as it slashes into your uh, to your arm. Uh, Thank you. It sticks. <laughs> You're like oh, okay. This is mine now. Is it? Yes, please. You know I'll get it back. But I want it. Rufio, you're up. Uh, because he's just through it. Absidy, can I go? Can I flank him and be at advantage? Uh, you, you would both have to be like, he put himself directly in the middle. Got it. So you would be in range to attack him with your sword. You just, it wouldn't be at advantage. So I don't have, I don't have my held action to. Your held action was. was Oh, okay. I wasn't sure. I was was clarifying. Yeah. Okay. okay. I'll, I'll still move forward and attack him with Mongo's Claymore. Uh, that is a 14. 14 hits. Yeah, it does. Uh, eight, 13, uh, 17 plus two is a 19. 19. Nice. Let's keep going until, uh, 
somebody falls down. Until someone... Do you know what happens when revenants fall down? No, I don't. I guess we'll find out then, huh? Yes, we will. Unless you're, you know, not good at fighting. Mm, I think we're going to find out. Shut you up. Remember, I do have cloaks. <laughs> I will remember that. I will remember. <laughs> That's something I heard, like, at a, at a bar. And he's just talking to you while Shard's preparing himself to fight him. What'd you get? Uh, 14. Uh, 14 hits. Oop, missed. <laughs> I missed. Well. <laughs> uh, that is 11, 13. 13? Yep. Okay, 13 points. And you're you're digging into him and you see the wounds that he has. He's just been cut up so much. And he just, he's not looking tired at all. But you, you see all of his things start to, like, his arm is starting to, like, dangle uselessly. And his, uh, just all the cuts around him are slowly closing, but they're getting a little bit slower than they were before. Absidy, you're up. All right, I'm going to... He's like Logan. Line up a little bit. Okay. And uh, short bow sneak attack. No, not the short bow. No, not that. Short bow, short guy. Got it. <laughs> uh, 17. Or Se- 17? 19. 19 hits. They all hit. He doesn't have a high armor class. No, he's got the same as me. It's 13. He's, he just wears leather armor. Uh, one, one, four, three. So five. Nine. Nine. Okay. And you see him and he kind of, he ducks, like he doesn't duck down. You see him, his knees start to give a little bit. He's like, okay, cool. Uh, cool. And you see things start to, to close up again. And he goes, all right, no, I don't. I'm good. And you see him teleport and he sit next to Irina and he goes, okay, okay, okay. I give, I give, I give. And he didn't pick up his axes. His axes are both over there. And he's like, all right, I'm good. Wave the flag. I don't have a flag. Wave the flag. Uh, here, and he goes, can I, can I, can I, and Irina has the cloak around her. And he goes, can I, I'm, I'm just a little bit. And he just gingerly takes it off. And he starts doing this with it. Flag. And he slowly puts it back down. He's like, you smell lovely. I don't want I don't want to like weird you out, but. <clears throat> Does anyone else know that she smells like lavender? Like it's, that's that's normal, right? Yes. It's like and a Irina's like, too. Irina's like, please stop talking. And he goes, Oh, whoo. That was fun. That was fun. I had a good time. Did you have a good time? I had a great time. Can I have your axe? No. <laughs> <laughs> Wanna throw the trees? <laughs> it's still in my arm, so I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> I'm going to get my axe back. I don't think it right. yeah, stayed you in your not. arm. You got a little tiny baby arm. It's arms. still in his arm. Like, Absidy hasn't taken it out of his arm. Like, you might want to... He's got little baby arms. Take. But if I take it out, then you'll take it back. And I want it. I mean, he took both out of Shart's chest. I don't think he'll have a hard time. It's not going to be hard. I'm not going to lie. It doesn't feel great. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Okay. Yeah, so I All right. Come on in. Bring it in. Bring it in. Are we hugging? Oh, yes. I don't want to bring hug it. You. <laughs> I don't. I'm bleeding on you then. Yeah, that's okay. It's cool. I like it. And he kind of puts his arms like <laughs> around your shoulders, and uh, Absidy kind of comes up and he puts his head on Absidy's head, and he uh, casts Cure Wounds, and you guys heal up eleven. Oh, that's almost as much damage as you did to me. <laughs> See, good as new. No. And while he's doing that, it's still in Absidy's arm, and he just goes. <laughs> And you feel this just searing hot, like, oh, God. <laughs> and he straps it back to his uh, his belt. Are we done with the battle map? Yeah, we're good. Hit it. Yeah. Ow. I'm also going to use uh, 12 lay on hands on myself okay. to get back to full health. Oh, dope. You're paladin. Yeah, we, we had this conversation last night. Oh, yeah. I forget things. Whore, right? Yeah. Oh, man. When's the last time you prayed to him? Uh, not recently. You should probably do that. Oh, okay. I don't... How I don't. Do I... Is this your first time being like a paladin? Yeah. Being holy? Yeah, I'm not... not yeah, being... if you don't do that, your powers are going to stop working. Okay. So you should probably do that and talk How to him. How do I do that? <clears throat> I mean, don't you talk to yourself all the time? Sometimes. I mean, it gets lonely if you don't, right? Yeah, obviously. So just talk to him. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Find a church. Read a book. Yeah, read a book. There's I don't not. I think he knows how to read. I don't know. I really don't. I don't. I really don't. What does well, even illiteracy mean? <laughs> Got a there's, minus there's one on intelligence. Really, <laughs> there's not really any churches or libraries around here. Is, is yeah. that a hindrance to that? or? I, just, mean, I mean, not here. Is, I mean, you're going a, to Volcali. 
is that a is it just kind of like a kneel by your bedside kind of thing and i mean it's whatever you want it's in your heart weird trust in the heart of the cards you, were you loved as a child like mm. i i'm very confused by you he gets Who sweaters you? werewolves you get oh 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 don't want to talk about it okay cool cool we don't have to talk about it where do we go from here uh, and you see him, he pull up, pulls up the map and he go, and he's showing you on the map. He's like, you're going to want to keep walking, uh, this track and, uh, yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna get about here. Vakali or Valaki is here. Uh, yeah, just keep following the path. You don't want to stray from the path. What happens if we stray from the path? I mean, you don't go where you want to go. I mean, you could try to cut Fair. through the woods, but you've been in the woods, right? Yeah. Wouldn't advise that. Have you seen all the fog lately? I once, once there was this guy who went into the fog and he completely died of exhaustion. Okay. Like in so an hour. So we're going to stay to the path. Like he died. He was I'll, dead. Um, like I'm good. Like I, I could go through. Like it's not, it's not a thing. You're already dead. Yeah. We yeah, get it. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Uh, I'll also reach out and put my hand on Shart and give him the rest. The other eight lay on hands. You sure you want to do that now? Yeah. Are you positive? Because yeah. we still have a while till we can long rest. That's not necessarily true. We're going to be walking a little bit. And before we do something like this, or before we go into our next thing, I think a long rest would make sense. Uh, no, I, I, I agree, but I'm just saying... Uh, I, I put my hand on Shark right. and I say, I fucking hate you. And uh, give him eight lay on hands. I think they want to fuck each other. I think so. And Dirt's like, I have also detected hints of sexual tension between the two. I'm observant. Be observing sleeping outside tonight. I always sleep outside. Well, it's gonna be worse now. <laughs> we uh, the, how is it gonna be worse? More outside. <laughs> well, how can I go more outside? They'll figure something out. I've shared bed with many people, so I you know whatever. Kinky. Actually, you don't sleep outside. You sleep with Shart. That that oh. wet dog smell. That's him. Yeah. And Dirt's like, oh good. <laughs> yeah, it is. Great. He likes to be Little Spoon, just so you know. Oh, great. <laughs> it's relaxing. Tell me it's not. You know what? I like to call that one the backpack. Ah, oh, it's so good. <laughs> it's good stuff. Every yeah. time you just, sometimes you just want to feel safe. The embrace. You just want to feel secure. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's good. Right. It's nice. Yes. I I appreciate you running us through the gauntlet, I yeah. guess. And you seem uh, sharpening his axes. Yeah. Is there any way you can get us a, a bag of holding? This one likes to steal, and we will soon be out of space in all of our packs. That reminds me, cloak? Two cloaks. Fine. Thank you. And you see him, and he starts taking off his clothes. And you see all of the his wounds start to slowly heal up. But you see all scars along him. Like, where it's Wolverine, where things just kind of close up and it looks fine. He's just fucked up royally. Like, you just see all these battle scars and marks. And you see him on his cheeks and on his back. And uh, as he slowly puts it on, he's like, bag of holding. Um, I mean, that might be kind of hard to find in Barovia. I believe in you. Aw. <laughs> he kind of looks around. He's like, I, cool. Uh, He's like, you have feather bands. I want one. I mean, I have to make one, but I can... Make me one. <sighs> Where are those wolves? The, I'm sorry, what? I need the leather. Need leather? I mean, can't you just use the guts of the werewolves? Yeah, but... They smell. Yeah, that's what, that's what I was going to use. Okay. I mean, they're around you. They're in <laughs> like Their They're bodies scattered are around. Just okay. in the forest. I'll be right back. What about... um? Potions. Can you help us with that at all? Ooh, that's a toughie. Okay. Um, yeah, we haven't had any health potions or anything like that in a long time. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, and he starts feeling around on himself, and he kind of pulls out, and you see this little tin box, and he goes, it's not a potion per se, but it's a medicine kit. I don't need it, but I, I like stealing things too. Hey, I like friend. looting things. Hey, Armano. <laughs> hey, Armano. <laughs> so, you know, I mean, it's not going to heal you, but it'll stabilize you. Oh, that'll help. I appreciate it. And Irina that. goes, please, for the love of God, take it. <laughs> As she's shaking in her, she's not doing well. So what's going on, brown eyes? <laughs> and, he, and he kind of gives it, he kind of puts it onto the log. Ah, well, I mean, you guys have a lot of travel to, uh, to get to, huh? Seems that way. Should probably get to it. Are you not coming with oh, us? Oh, me? No. Why would I come with you? Because you're stuck here. Yeah, that's just because I'm stuck here doesn't mean what your mission is the same as my mission. Well, what's your mission? I have no idea. Us either. Maybe we have the same one. You don't know that we don't. <laughs> Lawyered. Lawyered? Your logic <laughs> is sound, law. illiterate one. Thank you. 
We can steal a bunch of shit together. Yeah, okay. I can hang out. Dope. And you see him... He goes, so... Onward. Yes? Yeah. Hi ho, hi ho. So do I get a horse or do I ride on with someone? Or... That kind of thing? <clears throat> um, I'm already pretty heavy, so I wouldn't recommend sharing one with me. And I'm but, already sharing with Irina, so... Dude, you sharing with Irina? He is. It's like a brother-sister relationship. <laughs> but like the porn kind. <laughs> <laughs> and Irina's like, what? <laughs> Nothing. She, uh, what? Okay, cool. Um, Can't unsee that. <laughs> Can't unsee that. Uh, I mean, you're, you're riding with, a, are you riding with anyone? Uh, my squire. So, realistically, I have to ride with you. I mean, how much do you weigh? He kind of jumps up, and he <laughs> he jumps, and then he goes back down. I don't know. Like, <laughs> well, I, I mean, as I long mean, as the horse can hold us, I guess it's all right. It looks, which horse is yours? Uh, and you see this, like, horse, like... <laughs> that one. The one that's traumatized. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> as long as you're not galloping, I don't mind walking. I walk. We can... Take turns walking. Aw. Yeah, we'll make it work. Guys, that's nice. Dude. <laughs> Dude, sweet. <laughs> and so, uh, at this point, have you finished your little feather yeah. band? So he's like, I don't... I'm gonna... He puts it around his neck, and so he has these, like, bird feather, like, Black Panther kind of thing. He's like, I think this kind of goes with the outfit. Like, it's going with my look. Like, it's pretty good. I like it. I like it, too. It's, it's nice. It's if you nice. want me to put some into one of those cloaks, I can do that for you, too. Sure. We're going to be sitting for a while, so. We're going to be walking and talking for a while. I like making A good old shit. West Wing walk and talk. You don't get that reference. And he keeps, <laughs> <laughs> he starts walking. Great. So you guys start heading out. Um, I would say after your little interaction, it's maybe about 10 or 11. And so you have at least a full day's travel banged up and, you know, you're sticking to the path. You're trying to avoid, you know, wolves and anything you guys want to do as you're, as you're traveling through the day. Um, anything you guys want to discuss? Anything you guys want to try to ask Gray? Irina, like, world's your oyster. So, Gray, why can't you do your spiral thing? It won't let me. I keep trying to, and it just, I think I'm landlocked for a second. Hot minute. I'm sure it'll come back. This I've been playing before. locked. I, uh, yeah. Yeah. Kind of, I'm like, so I'm, I'm kind of like, like a planes cop. Does that make sense? Like, you know, wow. sheriff guards, they kind of, like, they guard the city. Yeah. yeah. I kind of right. guard different planes. So are other planes not in danger? Is this the one that's readily... I mean, there are a few of us, but, you know, I don't, once again, don't know what the task is. And I usually wake up in a different body. This is the current body I'm in. Gotcha. Sweet. Yeah. Not a big dick. <laughs> mm. I'm just kidding. It's huge. And he looks over at Irina, and she's like, not having it. He's like, wow, she is stingy. We let wow. di dial it back. Dial it bit. back. Just, just, I can't just dial a, it back. Just it's a, hard. It's hard. It's not. That's what she said. It's not. <laughs> it's not. It's, it's not. It's not hard. <clears throat> it's not funny. Um, no, I mean, I've been, I've been landlocked for a while. I mean, once I was, uh, I was landlocked for three weeks. That sucked. Tell us about the last time you were in Barovia. You you talked about Strahd, like you've battled him before. I have. What do we have to look forward to? What is... Oh, look forward to? Pain. Well... Suffering. I mean, he killed me one time, and that's how I... That's Wait, why I'm here. So, did he kill you? He killed you in a different body. Oh, in my original body. Oh. I was handsome. I bet. I guess I that was, went to, I was gorgeous. That went to hell in a handbasket oh, real quick. It did. I hate this body. But yeah, no, he he's he's fucking he is he is brutal. If I can Strahd is very dangerous. He's not going to pull punches. If he aims to kill you, he's going to kill you. Yeah. Okay. For boating. Oh boy. Thanks. Yeah, you know, I wanted to comfort you because you know, this whole confidence cocky thing, oh, it's just it's just a front. I'm actually super scared right now. Great. Yeah. Also, uh, while we're at it, if you any if you 
you ever have any issues with me like you showed to him earlier, talk to me about it, maybe. All right? We're a group. That's fair. I think I've I mean, earned you, that respect from you. You didn't tell us about your brother and the reason you were in... We wanted to go to the Vistani camp so bad. So if you can keep things from me, I can keep things from you. Fair I'm going to go enough. take a leak. You guys talk about that. Fair. I have a tooth. <laughs> what kind of tooth? It's a boar tooth. You, are you guys going to run or do I have to... Ca- I'll, I'll teleport. Yeah, you're fine. You're fine. Yeah, I didn't tell you guys. I didn't think it mattered, but I have a tooth. And I don't want you to get mad at me. So, a tooth from what? Uh, it had my boar on it. Or from a boar. I'm assuming it's my boar. Gotcha. It said XYZ on it. What, so. what else did you find? Um, that was it. It was just like wrapped up in a little thing. Then with the feathers that I've been making for all of you. So, oh yeah, I'm a boar riding champion. I forget if I told you that. I'm real good at it. That's neat. It, so It came up. Yeah, okay, just making sure. Yeah. Irina, I'm really good at stuff. <laughs> Not horse stuff, though. Yeah, well, they're very large. <laughs> You're just very small. <clears throat> okay, but... What did you find at the Vistani camp? I found financial freedom. I'm out of the rat race now. <laughs> My old man's dustbin. He wears a fancy hat, and he starts singing as he comes back over. I didn't wash my hands. You see, I just kind of shake something off. His I mean, hands. considering That's... you pissed in the woods, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I thought I'd be upfront about it. Thank you. Great. Oh, I see what you did there, puns. What? <sighs> Great. And he's just staring, and he's just like, he's, it's hard to get a read on him. He's either super optimistic, or you see he's slightly dead inside, like literally, and metaphorically. He's like, ah, ah. What do you know about these, uh, these tasks we're supposed to do? Oh, yeah, you were telling me about those. Yeah. So, I think, what was it? Uh, artifact. Abjurer. Abjurer. I feel like, I mean, I don't have all the answers, um, cause you know. Some would be better than what we currently have, which is none. Usually, hmm. What, 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 what do you got? What do you got? Cause he looks at you like concentrating. Uh, let's see. Uh, abjurer, philanthropist, evoker, tempter, the artifact, and then obviously the message for you, um, <laughs> that we already gave you from Madame Eva. Uh, and I know that you're pissed about that, but. We she just, don't she just, shoot the messenger. She just, she just mocks me constantly. She sucks. She's really nice and, to uh, us. The only other thing that we were told in there is that we need to stop any force that tries to stop us. I mean, that's kind of a given. Uh, kind of self-explanatory, yeah. Yeah. Um, what was the first one again? Uh, the Abjurer. Abjurer. What, what uh, went with that? Fallen house by a great dragon and sword of sunlight. Stone, stone dragon. dragon. Oops, stone dragon. Look to the highest peak. Oh, to better understand oh. your enemy. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's um, there's like, what was it again? And you you see him kind of like talking to himself. And he's like stone dragon, stone dragon. Where have I seen a stone dragon? Uh, if it's still there, um, I mean, I think there's a stone dragon. Whose crypt was it? It was a crypt. I gotta remember. Um, shit. It's not coming to me. So is it a real dragon? Or a statue. I think it's a statue. Hopefully. I don't know. I never really got close to it the first time around. I just kind of went. Kind of just stuck yeah. to the path. I do that. Wait, so we have to go off this path you just told us to stick on? Like, not this. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, Not <laughs> this physical path. Oh, okay. So, yeah. I think it's I think it's a, I think it's a statue. Or it's a gargoyle. Or it's a stone dragon. Like an actual, like, oh, those Have are you all fought different. a dragon? Those are awesome. Not yet. No. They're terrifying. Yeah. Oh, I man. Would assume you so. haven't lived until you fought a dragon. Give us time. <laughs> huh? We I barely assume that you, got that you're going to get you. to it. <clears throat> I'm just assuming so. It's, it's, you know what happens when you assume. <clears throat> sometimes yep. you're wrong. <laughs> you die sometimes. Fuck me, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what about the philanthropist? I don't have notes on that, so. The philanthropist? Look to a place enough. where. Sickness and madness are bred. That one. I mean, that just the sounds like a riddle. Still. And then there's treasure where the children lie. I remember oh, that dude, one. Dude, a kid graveyard? Oh, I don't like That's that. That's not great. <laughs> I'm just spitballing here. Like, things are different from when I was here. Uh, so um, people, like, if it's referencing people, pretty sure I haven't met them. What about, what about 
this one talks about a wizard. Yeah, find uh, the staff of the evoker, wizard. Evoker, search for the crypt of the wizard. Oh, maybe that's the crypt. S- staff is the key. That one, again, she looked at me for, so I don't know what. Fuck do I know. Okay. <laughs> great. Great. No, this is going, I thought this is, this is going great. What else you got? The, the tempter. tempter. Uh, child Vistani, her fate hangs in the balance, and she's at a lake. Ooh, you guys passed the lake, right? Was there a kid bobbing in it, like, face down? Sorry, that was graphic, Irina, and she's just, at this point, she's just rubbing her temples, just trying to ignore Gray at this point. I don't think she likes me. I would agree with that. I'm going to work on that. You good luck. <laughs> uh, thank you. I just, there wasn't a kid, like, in the in the lake, Not right? that we saw. No, just I mean, not. there's, like, there's another lake. Uh, I don't know if it's still there. Are any of these places kind of on the way that we're I mean, going now? There's there's the Lake of Zarovich. That's that's right next to the the town. Maybe it's there. <coughs> the town. Maybe. Okay. The Locky. Uh, Where are you going to? It's on the way. Well, it's not on the way. It's actually there, and then you have to leave the town and go. I, I digress. You you can't miss it. It's a big lake. It's close. Got it. It's yeah, close and to you see him going. pull out the map, and he's like, I would say it's kind of like here, and he kind of circles above the town. So it sounds like there's a child there that she foretold, and I hope that kid doesn't like swimming because they're not good at it. Mm. Uh, mm. L- l- the last mm. one we got was uh, Artifact. Uh, it will He will lead us to him, entertaining man with a monkey, more than he seems. I don't know anyone with a monkey. I mean, I probably do, but I don't think it's probably going to be the same person. Not a great pet. There was this one, like, Italian guy, and he had this little bone grinder and this little monkey with a little hat. Is it named Giuseppe? (laughs) Kind of. It was Bobo. He was dope. Was the guy's name Giuseppe? I never asked him his name. I was just more infatuated with the monkey. I was kind of assuming. Can can you see monkey? Like, I've never seen a monkey. (laughs) Are you... An optimistic person, or are you dead inside? Oh, no, I'm totally dead inside, 100%. What do you think? Got a better read on you now. Don't know why you you even asked that question. (laughs) I mean, once again, how many times I've died, come back, died, come back. It's it's, it's annoying. Is there a god? Uh, There are gods. Is there an afterlife? Yes. Do I get to go? Probably. Can I keep the stuff that I stole? I mean, you don't really go with your things. Can I steal more stuff there? No. Then what's the point? I think that's what a lot of people are looking for. That's a good point. Uh, Eternal salvation, maybe? Uh, no, that doesn't seem like it. 72 versions, depending on what you believe. Ooh. That doesn't seem like it. Yikes. <laughs> Watch out for this one, eh? Do you, really, do you really want 72 virgins? They don't know what they're doing. <laughs> it's all teeth. <laughs> <laughs> they don't. They don't know. <laughs> They don't know. And Dirt's like, what does that mean? Uh, don't worry no. about it. We'll tell you, you when you're older. You see, when a man loves another woman or another man, no. you know, don't be, no. don't be now's rude. Not, now's not the time. He's, he's like, let him, don't let be close minded. Let, let him sit. Now's not the time. Let him sit. When you're old as I am, I mean, you you get things in, man. How old are you? Uh, I've lost count. Cool. I'm old. Dope. I mean, half elves kind of live to be, well, I wasn't a half elf. What was I? Shit. All I knew, uh, I was just really handsome. What was I? Handsome. Elf? Was I an elf? And he just, he's trying to turn the gears and he just, I don't, I don't know. Not important. Old. Do you, will, will you have any indication of when you're going to be not with us? No. Will you, your balls clack together or something or what? <laughs> I feel like a tingling just in my pelvis. <laughs> no. It just, it kind of happens. I've had it to points where I can control it, and then I have other points where it just kind of opens and I have to go through it. Kind of like what happened when I met you, hence me being pissed off. Great. That was, I mean, that was a great time. Thank you for that. I mean, you know, flirting with the Fae, and then all of a sudden, like, I was going to get it. And then all of a sudden, I got another job. Well, I hope you get to go back to that soon. Probably not. No. Probably not. not. Have you been outside of this plane? Uh... Previously, <laughs> before we not not like this one. I God, mean, you already here. were in the fur like just the realm, the earth realm. I'm talking like Shadowfell, like the the plane of uh, air, nine hells, anything. Nope. No. And he goes, oh, uh, do you know what like what it looks like? Like, have you have you seen like a thing of it? 
I saw. Uh, you can roll history checks on me, for me. Uh, it's cocked. <coughs> well, that's even worse than what it was cocked at. 17. 16. So, Two. so I mean, being a mountain <laughs> man, that's fine. Uh, a little bit in school when you guys were, were growing up, you heard about different ways of the planes, but you never saw like a physical map of it. And so Gray kind of just takes the piece of paper that he was scribbling on and he kind of hands it over. And he goes, so the middle part that's where you guys are at. Even when you're in Barovia, it's still there. That's the uh, that's the regular just realm. You can't look at maps. And then, gotta, I can look at maps. And then you, you see him put his, his fingers up in the L's. He's like, and then the left one is the Shadow Fell. That's where all like the dead people go, like uh, Raven Queen. Like that's that's super cool. And then to the right, like immediately, like in that little bubble, that's where I was. That was the Feywild. So I was just kind of on the cusp of that. Uh, and then I believe to the east is the Earth Realm. Uh, or the plane of Earth elemental, and was it this the... one? This little bubble here. Oh no 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 no! That's the Fey one. The so whole that... thing is the Fey one because so there's the... three things. in So there. the middle one is where he, we are at. Right oh now. okay. Where we are. And then to the right, that little bubble is Fey. That's Fey. Yes. And then to the left is the Shadowfell. But you read Elven. I do. So when you read it, you can see the yeah wrote it in Elven. Yeah no, it's perfect. Wait, so this is the Fey, or this is the Fey? No. Go right. There you go. So this God is Shadowfell or this is Shadowfell? So the little bubble Shadowfell. What's the big thing? So the big thing, that's the plane of air. Ah. It sounds, uh, sounds like air. Does that mean air? I mean, it is. I yeah. mean, I made little wind symbols. I thought that would be nice for me. It's super helpful. You're illiterate. I mean, you can read it. Yeah, no. Ooh, I mean, it's air. <laughs> <laughs> little whooshes. Yeah, I mean, you could keep that Fire. if you want. What's, if you want to have it. Yeah, what's Fire. above and below? Water. To, He's got it. Earth. He's looking at the symbols. That's a diamond. Yeah, I mean, like I earth. can't I can't draw rocks, so, like, diamonds. Diamonds are in the earth, right? I get him. Yeah, we get each other. We finish each other's sandwiches. <laughs> Maybe you guys And you touch his hands, the and they are just cold. Oh, oh sorry. <sighs> That's okay. Okay. Ow. That was mean. Yeah. <laughs> Super I'm just, mean. I gave you cloaks. You did. We're friends now. Kind of. I'm just so kidding. Come back. Stop okay. kicking our asses. Mm. And once again, they're still super cold. That's not any better. <clears throat> You're like a walking morg. <laughs> kind of like a morgue. <laughs> uh, so as it slowly starts to get lower and lower at nighttime... And uh, you're you're a good a good chunk out, and Gray's just talking to you guys, and you guys start setting up camp. And he goes, "You guys are really fucked. I don't kind of need to sleep, so I can watch everything if you want." Uh, yeah, that would would be nice. Help. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. 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 No doubt. No doubt. No doubt. So you guys, yeah, you guys rest up for the night, and then I'll let you guys get the benefits of a long rest. Because we're about to get our asses kicked. Okay, so I got my short dice. Short rest hit dice back. Justin, what's our time at? Uh, you're, we're at, I think, 120. So I should hold off on going to the bathroom. Well, I mean, it's, it's another 10-ish minutes. I mean, we'll, we'll probably end it up soon. I'll Just go, go bro. You can go now. Josh is the bladder of a child. Well, I am back to having 38 A strong hours. child. Is he a sexy child? <laughs> a sexy child. You, you a sexy kid. <laughs> like me when I was 10. <laughs> At least that's what my uncle said. Oh, no. <laughs> Not my uncle. <laughs> okay. Uh, so we long rest. Anything you want to... Do you want to pray to whore? Yeah, I want to pray sleep? to whore. Um... <laughs> So, bud. so tell me, <laughs> tell me what you guys haven't talked in a while. Hey, man. Um, so, uh, God, whore, uh, I didn't know I was supposed to pray to you. So here I am, uh, doing this, I guess, for the first time. Um, I would really like to know what, uh, what path I should be on if I'm on the right one. If there's anything that I need to do in order to make you happy with me to not 
take away my powers or <laughs> so anything. So, are you saying it as you're going to sleep or as you wait when you wake up? Uh, going to sleep. Okay. So, as you're kind of rambling and you kind of do that thing where you're thinking and you just slowly drift off into sleep, and right before you lose consciousness and you go off into that gentle like blackness of uh, sleep, you feel this fire in your heart start to burn a little bit as you sleep. Heartburn? Not heartburn. Oh. Kind of what you felt before when he touched your, your chest. So it's like an acid reflux? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's like Ashley Simpson. You need to take some, uh, what is it, Pepsi and AC? Yeah, you just Pilo need to take some Pepto, Pepto Complete. So I just felt You like... just feel like he's still there. Okay. So you feel assured, like, you know, Gray said that if you don't pray to him every day, he's going to go away. But it looks like maybe he gave you a little bit of leeway. Sweet. So you got to... I would say if you take Gray's heat of advice, pray to him every night or every morning when you wake up. Got it. Okay. I'll do it while I'm on the watch. <coughs> do, both. do both. Do you, you know? believe in magic? And so you slowly, everyone slowly gets up and Gray is sitting. Whoops. Uh, there's a log in front of the fire that you guys have been surrounding and Gray's back is to you and he's just sitting there with his two axes and he's not moving. He's super still and he's just staring off into the fog and as you guys stir awake, he goes, Morning. How's it going? Uh, all slept well, I suppose. Yeah. Yes. So, uh, not a lot to report. There were a few wolves. Uh, that was fun. Uh, don't worry. Didn't come close to you guys. I took care of it. Right now, I'm kind of looking at that. And he, and he, you see him put his, uh, his hand out. Go in ahead and roll, uh, what is it? Perception, uh, perception checks. 14. 22. 17. Okay. So all of you kind of look, and for you, it just looks like a shape on a horse, and it's slowly coming towards you. Uh, what would you get, 17? 17. You can kind of see that it's obviously a humanoid shape as well, but because you got a 22 shark, you're looking and you see uh, dead holes, nothing behind it. You see uh, white, bone white, on this horse that's just long skeleton. It's a And it's slowly just... Clopping and Wait, he goes, is it a skeleton horse too? It's a skeleton. It's a skeleton on a skeleton horse. Dope. And it's just slowly like just going. Uh, How far away? It's. I would say it's about fifty feet. Oh, should, so it's close. Should we? It's pretty close. Should we? And he kind of puts his hand up. He's like, "Don't mess with it, and it's not going to mess with you." And as he does that, you know, doesn't gallop. You see the the skeleton doesn't even turn its head at you. It just keeps. And it just passes you by. Yeah, don't fuck with those. What was that? Oh, that was it's a skeleton on a horse. <laughs> Where is it going? Cool. I don't know. I've never actually followed one. I don't feel like following one. Unless you guys want to follow one. You I was about it. to ask, do you want to go follow it? Go. Stay the path. Stay the path. Okay. 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 And you see him and he kind of gets up and he starts walking towards it. <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> And so as you guys get uh, situated, it takes about like half an hour, 40 minutes until Gray finally comes back. He's like, nope. It just kept walking. Like I was trying to like, eh, nothing, like nothing behind the eyes. Well, that's because it's a skeleton. Yeah. Did you yell at it? Yeah. No, totally. I yelled at it. I just didn't like touch it. I don't want to hit it because I feel like it'd get angry at me. Or it might just fall apart. It's fair. I, don't know. I mean, we're, we're kind of like cousins. He's dead. I'm dead. Fair. Dead family. Dead family. Did I have a family? And he, he starts let's walking, not, let's not walking on the path again. Introspective. I'm reaching out to poke you. Yes. Just wanted and to see what kinda, would happen. And you put your, your finger in, and it kind of just... Like, usually with their muscle, there's an elasticity. There's no elasticity. And you take it out, and you just see this dent in his arm. And he goes, wow, cool, rude. <laughs> You're very Apologize. pretty. You're squishy. <laughs> and he <laughs> kind of moves. He moves forward. Um, go ahead and as you're going out for the morning, you know, are you guys doing anything? Eating breakfast? Like, yeah, yeah for sure. Ration, gonna yeah. Eat. Anything yeah. you guys want to do as you eat that, talk over what you're going to do today. That, uh, that medicine kit, mm -hmm. is that a persistent item or is that a one-time use It's thing? kind of a one-time use. Okay. I have, I put it in my pack, so. No, I, I didn't know if it was the thing that let us make potions. No, 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 no. That's, uh, our. It's like an alchemist kit. That's what you okay. I was going to say. I wasn't sure if it's art. Yeah. Okay. I love breakfast. Food is good. Okay. So you guys are eating and hungry? Oh no, I don't eat. Oh, oh cool. All I right. appreciate it though. Is I don't I don't know what things taste like anymore. I don't have taste buds. Is that because you're dead? What? 
Is that because you're dead? Yeah. I got it. All right, well, uh, try I don't to be really polite. Need to... No, 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 it was, super, it was super polite. I appreciate it. I'm the it. homemaker of the group, so. Uh huh. That's nice. Irina, do you need food? And uh, she goes, that would be lovely. Thank you. I'll give her another one of my so, rations. They're all kind of sitting, and Gray's kind of like looking at you. And he's looking at Irina. And he's looking back at you. Like, he's kind of like behind her, so she can't, he can't, she can't really see him. And he's like, so Irina, um, you seen anyone or? And she goes, not presently at the moment, no. So you're available. Cool, 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 cool. And so what is your, like, what's your, like, deal? What's up with these guys? Uh, what's going on? And she kind of breaks down and she's like, um, well, I, uh, I was uh, visited by the one we hunt when I was very young, and uh, yes, I'm not very keen on the relationships at the moment. And he kind of looks, and he's like, <laughs> and then you see his eyes, and they kind of stern forward, and he looks, and he kind of rudely takes her her face or her face in his hands, and he slowly cranks it back, and she's like, "Can you not touch me, please?" And he's like, "Oh." Oh, and he's, he just kind of smirks to himself. That's, I get it. Cool. What? Nothing. It's just, it's, it's for me. Can it be for us? No. How would that be funny? Everyone gets the joke. You know what would you be wouldn't, really funny? You wouldn't get the Is joke. Is if everyone but <coughs> Rufio knew? No. It'd be funny if all of you didn't know and then you find out. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. I really don't care anyways. <laughs> I like him. <laughs> Uh, so you guys kind of finish up, and you're you're back on the path, and uh, go ahead and roll perception checks for me. Eleven. Four. Seventeen. Twenty. Okay. Not a twenty. So. Okay. So as you guys are walking uh, along the path, chit chat, there are, you know moments of silence, and uh, Gray kind of slowly walks up to to Absidy. And at this point, you you have heard rustling in the bushes every maybe five minutes or so. Like something's moving. And he goes, you were being followed, right? I think so. Yeah, I, I think so too. And he kind of like looks to the side and the bush stops. And he goes, okay, so I'm going to I'm gonna check check this out. So I'll be like right, be like right back. And so he go he goes over to the bush and earlier uh, earlier in your adventure you had seen these big hulking masses of people covered in mud and it kind of kept to itself. Yeah. And it you see it slowly come out of the bush <clears throat> and he grunts uh, at Gray and he goes and Gray kind of grunts back. And you see that they start communicating. Like he looks like he's going to be hostile towards Gray and then he kind of lets his guard down. And Gray goes puts his hand up and he goes um, I, I, I don't normally run into berserkers like this, but he's says we, he needs our help. Um, you guys up for like a little, like, like a little skirmish, like not a skirmish, like, like a, a side mission, like an advent side mission. Yeah. Well, you, you guys up for like a walk? Let's go for a walk. Okay. okay. I like walking, I guess. <laughs> Basically, uh, gray. So you start walking and you see these other two hulking berserkers next to this big head one. He's like covered in mud, but it's like war paint. And he's grunting more at Gray, and Gray's grunting back. And he goes, "That's weird. Um, berserkers usually go in packs, and they're saying their numbers are getting whittled down. And usually, like it's in battle or something like that, but they're just disappearing. What? What's big enough to take a berserker?" And he starts grunting back at it, and the berserker kind of... And Gray's like... Like, they're saying it's this big, hulking... Like, it's huge. You guys want to fight a monster? And with that, we will uh, we will end this episode of Dungeons & Drunk Joy. Awesome. Dope. Woo. Well, uh, guys, uh, make sure you like and subscribe... Uh, follow Justin and his multiple D&D games on Top There's Tabling. so many, please just watch them. There's so many. Uh, they're also <laughs> giving away dice on their streams. We are. Uh, so thanks to Die Hard Dice. Woo. And uh, yeah, so make sure you, you like, follow, subscribe, share. Smash that motherfucking like button. Yeah. Rage that like Ring button. Ring that bell. 
Maybe at some point we can get some diehard dice to give out. And baby, That'd be ring cool. That'd be that tight. bell. Uh, yeah. ring, ring my bell. bell.